Hello guys, this is Andy from Mooncake Visuals and today's video is a quick video about uh, customization so pretty much when I load the studio when you load any studio or template you can go to here style and here you're gonna go to this section so let me just reduce the frame per second now uh, navigation here is like FPS game so you use WSD to move around and you use Q and E to move up or up and down okay so now you right click on and hold the you know you hold the right click button and then you move your mouse so you can look around this is pretty much how you move around the scene so if you want to customize it you can just click here down below in the in this button and now you can see where you have the customization customization options every studio has different options so it's just a matter of you play along with them but you know this is how you pretty much customize them so some of them have elements that we can optionally hide and show we have uh, color parameters we have numeric parameters that we can play around with it but all all the studio has in common is this last these two which is effect and color correction effect pretty much uh, let me just show my PGM output here we're gonna see this about this later so in here right we have the glow how intense gonna be the glowing in the scene and also here we have lens flare effects if we want and also we have the tint for the lens flare and down below we have color correction where we can increase or decrease the brightness we have contrast we have saturation and also we have this cool global thing that we can use to add a team to our scene so pretty much when you're done you can just go ahead and save your template as you wish you can put whatever name you want and then there you go in future videos we're gonna see more you know more detail about elements and stuff like that so I hope you like this video. See you in the next video.